we've mentioned some of these kind of flare-ups in Kosovo for various reasons, right? I think we did an episode where we talked about how the right wing in Russia and Ukraine kind of really embraced uh, anything that was happening in Kosovo as like a kind of welcome distraction from what was going on in their, you know, in the war there. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, and that they were really like posting about it all the time, uh, how basically like, you know, Serbia and, and Kosovo are about to go to war over license plates and all this kind of shit. Really disproportionate amount of attention. Uh, and, and that's true in like Western media too, for these uh, like recent flare ups. Um, and then this weekend, there was probably the most major incident that's happened in years. And it doesn't get nearly the same coverage uh, either in the West or, you know, of course the, the Russians and Ukrainians, we, you know, that, that was a kind of side story for us, but like, you know, I was combing through telegram because last time, you know, as soon as something happened, they were all posting about it and there was like nothing it was silence. Hmm. And so what happened this weekend is a very kind of concerning and fucked up incident. Um, yeah. Yeah. And, you know, if you know anything about the history of the Yugoslav wars in the 90s, it kind of reminds you of some very early kind of incidents that happened, uh, mm-hmm. you know, before the war started. It has that feeling to it, like it's very scary. Right. So for people that don't know what happened, and I'm assuming that might be a lot of people, although I know that our listeners also are, you know, weirdos who, who follow this kind of thing as well. Fucking freaks. Um, <laughs> That's why we love you. <laughs> The, That's why the, you're with the us. The non-Balkan people, uh, listeners. <laughs> yeah. um, yes, yes. Uh, so the night between um, last Saturday and Sunday, um, at around like 2.30 in the morning, uh, a Kosovo police patrol intervened or stopped a group of armed men who were setting up a barricade outside of the village of Banska. Yeah, armed in uniform. Yeah. Armed and uniformed, um, setting up a barricade with trucks in, uh, outside of the village of Banska in the kind of Serb-majority part of northern Kosovo. Uh, a shootout ensued. Um, one of the Kosovar police officers uh, was killed and another was wounded. And uh, subsequently, the armed men broke into the monastery there. There's a medieval Serbian monastery there uh, and kind of set up in the monastery grounds. Fritz here. This has been a highly manipulative attempt to entrap you into our Patreon page at patreon.com slash tenipod to subscribe and get the full premium episode we've teased here. Also check out our Twitter account, also at tenipod, and follow us, subscribe, and get the latest updates as well as whatever garbage falls out of our brains. So we cool?